Welcome to the Rusted Garden. Today I want to show you how to test germinate or test sprout your seeds. If you buy seeds or collect seeds, you don't always use the full packet or you don't use what you collected that year. Seeds can last anywhere from one to really five years. The best thing to do is test germinate them and I'm going to show you how to do that process. The first thing you do is you start with two pieces of paper towel. You're going to fold it up something like this. And the reason you pre-fold it is so that you can write on there with a pen just what the seeds are. So these would be tomatoes and you would put which one it is, which variety. That's Baxter Bush. Uh, you also want to take an index card or a separate sheet of paper. You're also going to use that so you do tomato and it's Baxter Bush. And the reason that you do that is because the name sometimes can uh, fade away. And I'll show you what I mean in a second. So once you have the initial paper towel done, you're going to wet it, soak it pretty nicely, and squeeze out most of the water. And you're going to open it back up. The moisture in the paper towel is going to be your um, germinating environment for the seeds. So lay it back down. These are Baxter bushes. These are Sarah Galapagos. And you can also do other seeds. These are tiger melons. And I already did these three. I'll show you what the outcome looks like. But for the Baxter bush or for any of the tomatoes or any of the seeds, you basically take a pinch and you just spread them out all over the place. And if, for instance, there's 20 seeds here, 18 of them germinate. 5 times 20 is 100%. 5 times 18 is 90, so you have a 90% germination rate. But you mostly just want to do this so that you know that you have viable seeds, so when you plant them next year, um, you're not waiting around for a seed to germinate that's not going to do it. Once the seeds are down, fold the paper towel over, press it in, fold it inward again, and you're just doing... Uh, you can actually fold it however you want, but you want to fold it in a way that the seeds won't fall out the sides. And I know that the writing is right there. Just folding the top, bottom up, turn it over. So you have your tomato seeds inside the moist paper towel. Once you do that, quickly dab it again, get some water into there. You can see the tomato seeds. You need a Ziploc bag. The Ziploc will keep the moisture in. Drop the paper towel with the seeds in there. Also, you can either tape this on the outside or put it on the inside and you seal it. Put this in a place that's warm, 70, 75 degrees. It doesn't need to be in the dark. You're going to wait anywhere from four to eight days to see if the seeds germinate. Tomato seeds take about five to seven days. So here's my first pack that I did. Today is the seventh, so these have been six days. And you can see that even with a red ink pen, the ink bled out, so it's hard to read, but I can see Baxter on there. So what you want to do, let me shut that phone off. One interruption. So what you want to do is you want to do the index card so that you know what you have in there. Um, when I test germinate for the new season, I might have 14 different seeds that I'm not test germinating. So after about five to seven days pass, you just open it up. And I can already see the root hairs coming out. You just open it up and I will see that the Baxter bush now let's see, I mean, i give you an example, but you can see they, really most of them sprouted. You can see it here. So I know I have viable seeds and these will just go in the garbage. Um, I also did tiger melon seeds. And the tiger melons are bigger seeds. I collected them myself um, actually last year on August 1st. So these are a year, a year old. Here are the tiger melons, and you can see the roots coming out 
already. So even a year later, in two months, all these melon seeds are totally viable. If none of them sprouted, then I would know I'd have to get rid of this whole pack. So those are the tiger melons. And then I also did Sarah Galapagos, which is a smaller tomato seed compared to the Baxter bush. They take longer to germinate, so you can also check them. So I'll, I'll check them. I might leave them a little bit longer, but I mostly want to see that they're starting. And you can see that they are. There's little white roots coming out, and they're all viable too. So again, all you do is get a wet paper towel, put your seeds inside them, seal them in a Ziploc bag, make sure you label them, let them sit somewhere uh, warm for five to seven days, and then you'll know if your seeds are viable for next year before you plant. If you enjoyed this video, please check out my blog at www.therustedgarden.blogspot.com and check out my YouTube video channel. I now have over 90 garden videos. Thank you.